is wrong, so why do we carry this on in the air? Probably won't stay. Good morning. It is the first day of university. What the hell? It doesn't really feel like it because I'm at home. I made myself some weird breakfast. Like, I just have plain buckwheat because I didn't have any cucumber. Usually, I eat my buckwheat with cucumber. And then I literally just have red bell peppers because I was just in the mood for peppers. So, if you're new to my channel, I am studying computer science in King's College London. So, I'm currently in London, but I can't even attend class because it's not happening because COVID. So, I have a PPA lecture at 9 a.m which is programming practice and applications and then i have a cm1 tutorial time to join my first lecture i'm afraid watch me not be able to figure it out i don't remember how to get into the lecture oh it's here <laughs> it's starting in a minute but like look i'm in my lecture that's so weird that's so weird he's so smiley That's so cool, bro. It's like live. It's showing like what countries everyone is from. So my lecture just ended and it was an introductory lecture. So it wasn't like they didn't actually teach us anything. He said that we're only going to be coding next week. But right now I'm going to quickly sign up to um a cheerleading taster. I've never cheered in my life, but I'm so into like gymnastics, cheerleading, ballet, like those three favorite sports of my life. Like I just I'm obsessed. I've done gymnastics and I've done ballet in the past very long ago i quit ballet because of an injury i think the tryouts are on saturday i am so scared because i've never cheered before and this tryouts like picture cheerleading tryouts from like the movie that's where i'm going so we're gonna do a minute intermission because i want to let you guys know that this video is sponsored by skillshare so skillshare is an online learning community where you can learn anything from animation creative writing film and video fine art graphic design illustration music photography iu ix design web development i'm like reading off their page because they just have so much that you can't even i can't remember everything but but basically on average each class is about an hour long that's like the very average of it and then each class is then broken down into like two to seven minute lessons so the info is broken down into like bite-sized lessons so it's a lot easier to take in so, so a class that i would really recommend is this class called real productivity create your ideal week i think right now is the perfect time to take this class because everyone is starting uni and school and it's just like a very helpful way to try organize your week skillshare costs about ten dollars a month on an annual subscription but for a limited time only you can use the link in my description to get a free trial of the skillshare premium membership so go get a membership sign up you will not regret it thank you to skillshare for sponsoring this video i have so much to do today i have an amazon delivery coming i have to meal prep i have to go grocery shopping i have to do my laundry i have to do some mandarin chinese i have to edit my video so many things to do but we can get it done i have about 50 minutes now to prep for my next class i want to know your name Baby, you're bubbly and radiant. You got some flavor, and I'm trying to savor it. Palm gripped on the fruit. I'm literally so tired. It's only 2 30 p.m. and I'm ready to go to sleep right now So I'm gonna go outside go to the shop walk around breathe some fresh air Hopefully that wakes me up and then when I come home I'm gonna have to do more uni work, but it's gonna be like non live stuff. So it's like pre-recorded sessions I'm vlogging well, I assume you do it weekly and I assume it vlogs, hence the term weekly vlog. Yes. <laughs> do you actually know where we're going? No. I'm leading, I'm no, we're definitely direction. not going the right way. Hands flying out the window, which ain't nothing but mileage. I'll pick you up. I got you. 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 Stay by the poolside, summertime 14 Splash of cool water, you that you know me Wear your arms tight like a chain yeah. So tight, I can be your name But you're making no Match with the puka, deep and wet it When the day ends, it's the deep and wet it And the gang's all here yeah. Super soak in the heat But still, in the demons trying to run my race Grinding in the crowd I use, um, sorry, before I put my chicken in I don't mean to get a that's an angel the and the lacy all the prices data yeah so shout out to the homies in the basement i just still looking for the paper yeah oh, I can take a stand on the back row with your hands flying out the window which ain't nothing but mileage i'll pick you up i got you i got you i got you 
The organization for me. Beautiful. I think this is all I'm going to film for today because I'm just so tired. I'm probably just going to stretch. Yeah, I have about two hours to just stretch, edit, and whatever time is left, I'm just going to spend it on pre-recorded lectures. I'm literally not going to spend any time just like watching YouTube or Netflix just because I don't have time for that right now. I will see you guys tomorrow. I think I'm meeting up with Naria tomorrow. So yeah, good night. I'm going to go stretch. Um, I just can't film anymore because I'm just so tired. First thing I'm gonna do this morning is go get my dry laundry because I left it to dry yesterday I didn't get it. So let's hope it's like still in there because anybody can literally take it out. So So basically I'm gonna do university related things for 45 minutes and then YouTube stuff for 30 minutes So it's not really enough. I need to do much more on average I'm supposed to be doing eight hours a day, which is insane But they told us that we need like 40 hours per week So these lecture slides and this like problem-solving activity I'm like very positive that we did this in the lecture yesterday So I feel like I don't have to do that much So I'm just gonna go through everything make sure I've seen everything and then I'm gonna do this quiz like magic I'm not bitch and I have it You forgot but I have it Now you wish that you had it But all I gotta say back is If I gotta choose me I won't be afraid to If I gotta choose me I gotta do what I gotta do When I love you I lose me No I can't be attached to you no more Okay, so hello, what's up? I am ready. My outfit is very simple because today's weather is so like, I don't even know how to explain it. It's like sunny at some points, but at the same time, it's so gloomy. Yeah, that's what we're dealing with right now. But about 30 minutes ago, it was really sunny. So it's a bit of everything right now. So I'm gonna go get some breakfast or lunch and then we're ready to go. So today's gonna be my first time traveling on my own. Since I came here, I haven't traveled on my own once. Like I'm not that scared. I kind of know how to, but at the same time, I never really paid attention to all the signs because I would just follow people. But um, yeah, today's my first time traveling alone. So let's see if I survive. Also, there was a stabbing at the station I'm going to yesterday. So Hello! Bro, I'm so awkward with vlogging in public. Me too. You know, it's fine. We are exploring London for the first time. This is for the first time for me because I haven't seen anything. Is it? Okay, so Naria is literally like the sweetest person ever, but I'm going home now. It is 5.20 p.m. and I'm very excited to eat food. The place we were at is called Tate Modern. It's actually really, really cool, but there was one specific thing that I wanted to see and it's like a mirror thing and we couldn't find it and it just felt really bad because I was just like, let's go look for it. And then it was like, it was there somewhere, but like we kept missing it, but. I'm in my room now eating dinner because I have so much to do. It's insane. But today's actually my first time trying quinoa as well. And I really like it. And I'm so relieved that I love it because I made four or five servings without ever having tried it. So I'm really glad that I like it because this means I can actually eat the food that I made. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're gonna to be freaking studying with what's that study tube name? Uh, it's Weeby. It's Weeby. Sass studies. We're freaking Sass studies. We're gonna get you this first in your. Are they trying to get degrees? I don't know. 
Yes. We're gonna get our first in all of our degrees, right? Go on, Anna. Can I actually put this in? Yeah, you can. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, how do I see this? Mendel's Laws and Beyond. So good morning. It is a Wednesday. It is already like 2 p.m. because I woke up extremely late. Like I woke up at like 12:30, which is almost 1 p.m. But it was because yesterday we were watching the Trump Biden debate, and then I ended up going to sleep at like 4:30. Not a very smart decision, but a lot of people would be very surprised. But before yesterday, I didn't even know what Biden looked like. Very uneducated in American politics. I mean, I don't live in America, so I guess I don't really need to know. But I mean, it kind of affects the whole world. So, and I've just been doing like my lectures and reading for this whole time I mostly do them in the kitchen because in my room I feel very like lonely <laughs> there's always at least one person studying in the kitchen so I just like study there most of the time right now I'm just gonna wash my hair and get ready a little bit and then in 30 minutes I'm gonna call my granny because I haven't talked to her since I moved here and it's been like two weeks and then I'm just gonna do lectures all day until I have to go to my cheerleading taster which I'm so scared for but so I have about two more hours of work and then I have the cheerleading event and then it takes like 40 minutes to get there and then it's like two hours long and then it takes 40 minutes to get back and then in the evening my flatmates are having like a little pizza party it sounds weird but um I thought today would be a lot more productive than it has been but it's just because I woke up so late um but it's okay I'm like still kind of on top of my things like I'm a bit behind on my editing because I thought like I would be able to edit each day as it goes along but it's the third day and I haven't even finished editing the first day so I'm a bit behind on YouTube. I have until Sunday to finish this I think and it's Wednesday and I'm like 40 50% through um so uni wise i'm kind of doing okay because i think i have until sunday to finish it and it's wednesday and i'm finished like 50 percent of the work i think i don't know how much there is in the module that i'm doing right now but I'm really scared, but um, I'm gonna do a quite important call right now with a company that I'm really scared to work with I don't know 100% if we're gonna work together, but um, I'm gonna go check it out Okay, I'm about to run late for my thing because I'm supposed to like leave right now and I have not but the call went well I think I'm gonna work with this company and I'm like, oh my god. I'm so like shook. I'm shook 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 I'm literally like what what is my life? Fun times. So <laughs> Look at this, powered by plants. Both of us vegans. <laughs> it's a yes. Oh. <laughs> Would you like a treat? Would you like a treat? <laughs> okay, update time. All I want to say is that I'm extremely stupid. Basically, let me tell you a little bit about how the tasters went for the cheerleading thing. Now that I think about it, I understand what a taster is. Like, it's literally in the name. You get a taste of what it's like to be on the cheerleading team. In the moment, I somehow didn't understand that. I didn't catch the memo. I didn't, I did not understand that we were literally going to do cheerleading today. So I came in jeans a hoodie and nothing under the hoodie so I can't take the hoodie off and I oh my god imagine how I felt in the moment where I walk in everyone is wearing yoga pants shorts t-shirts and I am in jeans a hoodie um really non-sporty shoes and I just had to do a full two hour like workout stretching dance routine jumping everything in jeans i felt really stupid in the beginning but towards the end i was like honestly i don't care this is fun no one's gonna judge me for it like worst case scenario they'll feel bad for me that i'm so stupid to turn up in jeans but like it's, i don't care it's fine however my knees hurt so bad because the choreography we learned like the beginning part started like on the floor and um we kept getting the beats wrong so <laughs> we had to do it over and over and over and over again and then when we would practice later parts we would have to start from the beginning and the beginning would start on the floor so i literally have bruises all over my knees so this is my knees after the cheerleading practice wow